Um, this is a requested video by YOLO, who would like to know how to wire a call point to um, a sounder using a plug, and he would also like to know what plug to use. Um, so, just gonna use, I'm going to use a Banshee XL sounder, because is, I'm just going to use the newest devices that I currently own, which is my Banshee XL, which is a very common sounder, and my ESP. Magfire manual call point my SCP2R, which is also quite a common device. So uh, I'll begin by um, taking the call point off. This, ah, by taking the call point off the um, back box, which I will do um, through the ah through the power of editing. Okay, so the call point is removed off of its back box. Back box is here, and you're going to put it to one side. Um, so yeah, let's turn the call points around to um, see what terminals we need to um, use. Alright, so I've got a little circuit going on here. Um, the call point is uh, wired to the sounder using a 12 volt DC plug. And um, the um, ampage on that is about 0 0.8 amps. But I think you can go up to about 2 amps and still be um, your sounder and call point should still be safe. Call points, I think, blow at about 5 amps. Sound is probably about 3, I don't know. Um, if, you, if, you, if you don't know what I'm talking about, basically, ampage is the amount of electricity, voltage is the power that the electricity is sent at, and um, the, the plug that you will need if you're using a real fire alarm sounder is mostly a 12 volt plug at about 1 amp. So if, if you're buying a plug, basically you just type in 12 volt, 1 amp, and 1 amp is basically just 1A, um, and then just put power supply, wall plug, and you should get some results. Um, just make sure that it's um, that version. It can be probably 24 volts as well, because depending on the voltage rating on your sounder, it should say. Yeah, mine says 10 to 28 volts, um, and yeah. So, I think this should work now because I have it plugged in, so let's go. So yeah, you may have noticed that the LED didn't want to work on my call point. That's because um, most standard call points have uh, a resistor, so that limits the current that can go to the sounder, so the sounder is drawing lots of current so that LED doesn't have enough current to operate which is unfortunate but um, if you're using one of the, uh, the Chinese call points then um, you don't need a resistor or anything and that will make the sounder probably louder to not have a resistor in there because that doesn't resist the current so yeah um, I hope that helped and um, yeah uh, let me know if you need any more help with uh, anything it's it's um it's a pleasure to um to upload videos that that actually help people um goodbye